I'm Stephen Schur. As Hertz builds one of the largest electric car rental fleets in the world, there's one question I'm often asked about electric travel. Are we there yet? To answer that question, I'm setting out on a series of EV road trips. First stop, Detroit, Michigan, the historic heart of the American automotive industry. I'll be taking a drive with one of the biggest players in the EV space. Hey, Mary. Hey, Stephen, how are you? Great, good to see you. Thanks for joining me. So tell me a little bit about the car. I think this car um, represents so much for Cadillac because it's our first electric vehicle and it also captures all of the work we've done to have Cadillac truly be the standard of the mm -hmm. world with the craftsmanship. I'm so proud of this vehicle and the response to it has been so strong, we literally can't make enough of them. Well, I will say at Hertz, we can't wait to get these and I think you know Hertz will be an interesting way to introduce people, not just to the Lyric, but to electric vehicles more broadly. You held uh, a number of different jobs. In fact, I suspect almost any possible job <laughs> in your career at General Motors, which I suspect puts you in a position to be a much better leader of the organization. But I'm just curious that path. Well, you know, I, I started uh, with General Motors literally when I was 18 years old. My dad was a die maker at General Motors, so mm -hmm. a second generation. I've had so many careers at General Motors, you know, being a plant manager, running HR, running product development, which is a really great job. Yes, I'll and, bet it is. And then, you know, this opportunity, and, and and I think it's also a message to women that you can be a successful mother and have yes. and, and work and have a, a substantial career. I look back and one of the things I'm proud about Cadillac is a hundred years ago, Cadillac was the first to, we General Motors developed and Cadillac was the first to deploy an electric starter. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. And why did they do that? Because one of the most difficult parts of driving a vehicle was the crank start. Right. In fact, I've been told that the word <laughs> cranky came, came from, from the crank start. Yes. I don't know if that's true or not, but it makes a lot of sense. It, it, it makes for a good story at the very least. So on the way in and on the way back from work, sort of what do you do? Decompress on the way home, but what do you do on the way to work? On the way to work, I'm always listening to CNBC. Yeah. I don't know about you, but I think that's kind of, you know, hearing what's happening in the world, especially in the in the corporate world. That's kind of my focus. On the way home, though, I'm generally listening to music. <laughs> I tell you, my, my son got me hooked on country music. I never thought I'd be a country music person, but uh, he got me hooked. I will say there's a common thread among 20 year olds and I have three boys and a girl and these are New York kids, okay, who are into country music. Okay, all right. So we're kind of cool. So then. we're kind of cool yeah. and pretty <laughs> hip. And so, uh, so that works out well. Tell me something, with electric vehicles, sort of in your view, are we there yet? In other words, are we, are we at the spot that we need to be kind of as an industry, as a country around electric vehicles. I like to say we're in the first turn of the first lap. Mm -hmm. uh, there is so much more to come uh, with uh, EVs. I'm super excited about the opportunity for people to have their first EV experience with Hertz, uh, especially in a GM vehicle. And I just see it as a launch point to really growing EV adoption. As we go down this uh, road here, we will um, end at the design building and the design dome, which is an iconic building on its own. So Mary, tell me a little bit about what we're gonna see in the garage here. The Chevrolet Silverado RST uh, pickup. I'm so excited about this vehicle. This truck just has so many great qualities, about a 400 miles plus of range. Wow. I think what people, when they rent this Silverado EV, they're gonna realize uh, they're not giving anything up. In fact, they're getting the pep of driving an EV. And this is gonna be out and delivered this year. This year, absolutely. That's we are terrific. ramping up right now. Great. So again, I can't wait to get these vehicles into the Hertz fleet so we can expose more customers to, to really what an EV experience is. Same here, great. Mary, great. thanks so much for spending Thank time. Thank you, really, really appreciate it. it. And really I, had a good time. And I really appreciate our partnership. Yes, as do we. Thank thanks you. a lot. Great. As Mary said, electric travel may still be in the first turn of the first lap. But with companies like General Motors producing a fantastic collection of electric vehicles and Hertz renting those cars to more and more people, it feels like we're on track. I hope you'll join me and another guest on my next EV road trip.